Welcome back to the channel guys and today we're going to be going over just like my deployment that I had so you guys can get a realistic uh, look into what a what to expect from a security forces deployment. Um, also if you guys are brand new to the channel just do me a solid go ahead and hit that subscribe button like the video and if you at the end of this video find that this information is helpful and you would like to check out some of my other videos um, go ahead and hit that bell notification and that's going to let you know when my new videos drop and uh, without further ado let's go ahead and get right into the video. Alright guys, uh, so today we're going to be talking about my deployment. So now this isn't going to be like a catch-all for every single deployment as security forces. This is just going to be my deployment in specific. Um, so my deployment, uh, we went to the Middle East. We had two separate squadrons. Um, one was like a main base style and then ours was more of like a little fob that was somewhere else that we worked out of. Now there's a big difference between the different two. Um, the main base, they had flyway security teams. So they had the fast teams that you could get on. Um, so that like created like some different opportunity for you to go do other things. But now also keep in mind that that's, there's also a very slim amount of people that were able to do that. Um, the vast majority of the, like that squadron was massive. So the, the vast majority of those people that were in there um, never did that whatsoever. Um, but other than that, uh, for the rest of that base side, like it was basically all just, they did law enforcement and they did security. Now for us, we did just security. That's all we did the entire time we were there. It was nothing but security. So we, so what you can expect from a security forces deployment, um, Based off of where I went, um, there's not like just go outside the wire patrols and stuff like that. Like some of our stuff was technically outside the wire, but it 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 wasn't. If it if that makes sense, it just wasn't. Um, it was classified as such, but it wasn't what you would think of as an outside the wire patrols and and, and missions and stuff like that. It was just normal checks, etc. Um, the rest of our duties there were just what you would have at a stateside base, but we were just in a deployed location. Um, we had different rules, different people. We did have different threats and stuff like that. So it is, it is a little bit different. Um, but all in all, it's almost the exact same, just in a different place. Like you still have your gates, you still have your searches, you still have your flight line stuff and uh, your patrols, but the only difference is we're not doing patrols for law enforcement purposes. We're only doing patrols for security purposes of our area. Um, and we weren't like just going out um, like the old school security forces used to do, we're not going out into the hostile environment going to seek it. Now, granted, that came as a disappointment to me because uh, I, I, I looked up everything based off of like the old school stuff that they used to do um, over in like Afghanistan and such. And uh, we just don't do that anymore. That's not our job anymore. Our job now is to protect our assets and and that's it. Um, that's kind of where the line is drawn now because they don't necessarily need our career field to do all the extra stuff anymore like they used to. Um, so that's kind of, I mean, I don't know, man, it's, it's kind of just like sums up the deployment. Um, I mean, I guess if you guys have any other questions or anything like that, um, I will be streaming on this YouTube channel. Um, you guys can hop in there. If you do hit the bell notification, it will let you know when I stream as well, because I stream on the same channel and you'll be subscribed to the same channel. Um, and that will let you know when I'm starting to stream. You can hop in a stream, ask any questions you want. And the majority of the time when I am streaming, 
I'm playing with a bunch of other military members as well, so there's also different points of view for every topic that you can bring up in that chat um, to get there. Also, I appreciate you guys because while I was gone, the channel wouldn't say blew up, but it uh, we definitely got like an additional 300 subscribers since I've been gone, and I wasn't posting any videos whatsoever. So I appreciate you guys for still watching my videos and still uh, supporting the channel. But uh, basically, if you guys can, um, we will be kind of going into different stuff in the future. So I will be putting out more videos. I will go into some gear videos of, of the gear that I had while I was out there, uh, how I had it set up, etc., to give you guys like a little helpful helpful hand if you guys do deploy and then you need to want to know how to set your stuff up kind of to be very functional. Um, so just stay tuned. The channel is going to take a turn for sure. Um, and that's, that's another announcement that I'm going to have to make in the future of why this channel is going to take a turn. Um, but for now, we'll just leave it off this deployment video and I hope it was helpful. And if it was just go ahead and drop a like comment down below. Let me know what you guys want to see down below. If there's things that you want to see or want to know more about, let me know down in this, uh, the comments down below and uh, I'll be sure to get everything I can to put those videos together for you. So until next time, I'll see you guys later.